Hi, my name is Stefan Nyman. I'm corporate trainer with CC Jensen and I'm also a Noria partner. Today I'm going to talk about the different variants of CTC products we have available. CC Jensen is a company with more than 65 years of experience within offline filtration. And offline filtration is also called kidney loop. You connect it to the bottom drain of the tank. It circulates the oil over the filter and make it clean. And Circulating the oil will clean it from particles, water, varnish, or oxidation products, and in some applications we also focus on acidity. We work with five different segments, so that is industry applications, power, mining, marine, and wind segment. And when you have a filter, a CTC filter on your system, what would be your benefits? Well, because we take all the contamination out, you'll be saving on oil and maintenance cost. You'll also increase the uptime of your equipment. And of course, you'll be saving on filters because we have a huge dirt honing capacity. So focusing on the fine filter series or the HU series, they all build up the same way with a sensor stay bolt here and a pump. The pump draws oil from your main system into the pressure vessel here into the housing where the oil is pumped through. A huge dirt hole capacity here in this filter insert and the clean oil runs near the center back to your system again. Yes, let's take a look at this demo unit that illustrates how the filters work. I'll start it up. Uh, oil is being cleaned by the filter, so the contamination is uh, in the first tank. The filter draws from the bottom and cleans the oil into the second tank. The fine filter series range from a few liters up to several hundred thousand liters, huge systems. So starting from the 1512 here, smaller mobile systems, hydraulic system, gearboxes and so on, a 1525 series, slightly larger systems, 1550, and to the 27 series here where you can stack the inserts for high, so for larger lube oil, hydraulic or gear oil systems. The fine filter also come in newer variations. The key filter here that is designed for primarily wind turbines where we have air containing oils uh, and a lid that pops up, so quick uh, change of the filter insert and also the Genie filter, which is a new variant of the uh, HU filter. So we have a stainless steel housing with a, a clamp connection, again for faster filter insert changes. A special variant of the CTC fine filters are these new lube oil filters that are designed for large marine engines. Uh, so they will circulate the oil on a marine engine. When the engine is in operation, it will produce a lot of contamination. And here, this special flow drive will circulate a lot of oil. While when the engine is stopped, the filter will circulate less oil because it's not needed. By doing that, we can avoid having a preheater uh, comparable to many other filters and centrifugal separators. We don't need a preheater like they do. The last variations of the fine filter is this new VRU or varnish removal filter that is designed for yeah, larger gas turbines, steam turbines, maybe hydraulic systems and compressors with a lot of varnish oxidation issues. Um, and you can see there's a lot of more engineering going into this, but it's based on the fine filter series. The filters we talk, just talked about are using absorptive technologies to take out contamination, including water. Which means that if you have a filter insert like this, it will get saturated if you have a huge ingression of water into the oil system. Which is why we have a second technology to take care of a lot of water. This is the filter separators. And the filter separators are still working with a filter insert in them, but they also have a secondary chamber, a collage or separation chamber that separates the water out continuously. The filter separators come in different sizes. So going from the 1512, the 1525, over to the 27 series. The smaller sizes would be for small hydraulic system or gearboxes. The larger sizes for larger diesel systems or steam turbines. Uh, so they would be equivalent to a centrifugal separator in those applications. They're separating water out continuously. Still have a filter though that will take out particles and varnish. Uh, but the technology is maximum for 150 ISO-VG oil. 
and without any emulsions. Because the filter separators are designed for maximum ISO VG150 oils without any emulsions, we have this technology, the desorbers, take care of more emulsions or special oils like bio-oils and such. This is using a patented principle where the dry and cold air is pumped through the oil and taking out water, continuously separating it out. There's also a filter built in on this D5 combi and the D10 combi. So the filter takes out contamination like particles, varnish, but also salt if it's seawater you have ingressing into the oil. This would be equivalent to a vacuum purifier or used in similar applications. The final products I'm gonna talk about today are these online monitoring systems. So here the hardware can sit directly onto the filter, a particle counter and a moisture transmitter, and the data are then sent to your SCADA system where you analyze them. Alternatively, we can use this CMU, which is again using a particle counter, moisture transmitter, maybe also an oxidation sensor and wear debris sensor, and the data are then sent to a cloud-based solution where we analyze it based on mathematical models. So if the trend deviates from the normal operation pattern, you will get a warning or a fault and then can take action. Thank you very much. My name is Stefan Nyman and go visit ctc.dk to learn more about our product or find a representative near you. Thank you.